The new Batman film is released next week. Obviously, it's got some actors and stuff in it, but the thing we're interested in is the new Batmobile. Watch this. <laughs> say that's bigger than the Batmobile I had when I was a kid. Yes, it probably is. It that's weighs true. two and a half tons. Yeah. It's 15 feet long. And it's actually the only car we've ever had in the studio that's wider than Jeremy's GT. I know, that's it's incredible. It's in itself. <laughs> that's amazing. And the important thing to bear in mind is that in that clip we saw, there's no computer-generated trickery going on. It's all for real. So they've actually given this thing a real 5.7-litre V8 engine. Now, here's the thing. Normally, when a car is built one-off for a film, they start off with something like a big old American barge and then they cover it with cardboard and bits of papier-mâché until it looks right. But this was built from scratch as a Batmobile. This is actually a Batmobile. And here's another interesting thing. When they showed the concept to all the American companies that normally come up with these special cars, they all said, can't be done, too difficult, all that back-to-front axle stuff. And the result of that is made in England. Yeah, absolutely. Now, of course, it's got to have lots of clever gizmos. So, needs to have guns. Here they are. Then, further down the car, when Batman stamps on the anchors, the enormous air brakes are deployed. Look at that. And finally, check this out for a party piece. You see? <laughs> With a car like this, Val Kilmer could be in the movie and you'd still want to see it.